up, guys? Welcome back. Today, I am actually out in Phoenix with my sister. We're here to catch the Suns playing the Brooklyn Nets. Uh, a lot of fun things happening tonight. Uh, today, though, I actually want to talk about how I ended up getting these tickets because I think it's really helpful that the way I got tickets is the way you guys get tickets. So pay attention. All right, so there are three main things that you need to know when buying tickets. So one, checking with the box office, see how much they are. Two, checking with secondary ticket markets. And then three, actually taking the time to make your final decision. So step one, checking with the box office. That's the first thing I did, went to Ticketmaster, took a look online, took a look at the map. Tickets were, you know, starting at around, you know, 20 bucks and kind of going up from there. Uh, so that's kind of where my first step was. So box office, that's the first place to look. All right, so first thing you did, you took a look at the box office pricing, excellent. Now the next thing you want to do is make sure that you're actually going to get a good deal. What does that mean? It means you got to check the prices compared to what it's selling for on the secondary market. So some games, prices will be higher in the secondary market, some games, prices will be lower. It really all depends, you know, on market factors, day of the game, who's playing, what the event is, so many different things. So with this game specifically, with the Phoenix Sun, so first thing I did is I took a look at Ticketmaster about a week before the game started. Tickets were about, you know, 20, uh, so $20 at the box office, about uh, 20, $25 on StubHub. So what did I notice? I noticed that after one day, prices had gone up incrementally, so slightly on like StubHub and other resale websites. So I was thinking, okay, maybe it's time to make a decision soon. But at the same time, it's like, you always wanna get the best price possible. So I decided, you know, I'll give it another day or two. So now we're looking at, you know, Wednesday, game is on a Sunday, so I'll have some time. You know, give myself some time. There's still a lot of inventory left to take a master. Wasn't too concerned. You. So then, you know, on Thursday, now we're kind of cutting a bit closer, looking at price on stuff. They're actually going up quite a bit now. Inventory on Ticketmaster was actually getting a bit much lower. Uh, and so I had to kind of make a decision. And so at that point, the first thing I looked at is, you know, are there any kind of promo codes or discount codes that I can use either on secondary websites or on Ticketmaster? Are there any kind of discounts that come up? Sorry, guys. Cool. Yeah, so then on Thursday, I went back to Ticketmaster, basically said, okay, what are my options here? And does it make sense to buy from here or from somewhere else? So what I noticed was that they're actually running a promotion for this specific game. So they were doing, for Veterans Day, they were giving out, you know, special GovX kind of promo discounts. And so my sister, who actually works with the public service in Canada, uh, she was actually able to qualify us for those discounts. And so, you know, with that, what it ended up doing is it made the price half the price of what I would have paid you know, on the retail market. Thanks, Tima. 